Craig Foster is here now because it's time for sports and Craig Anthony Mundine claims he was robbed of victory. Yes indeed Lillian, nice to see you as always. Danny Green was declared the winner of last night's long-awaited rematch but Mundine says he won the fight. The decision was met with shock across Australia and Mundine says it ruins the integrity of boxing. Even by boxing standards, this was truly something. The winner by majority decision. The Green Machine, Danny <laughs> Anthony Mundine celebrating in his dressing room like he was the winner, saying he should have won. A discerning eye saying, at the least, it wasn't a convincing Green win. I'm not going to say Mundine was robbed. It was a close fight. If you had Green winning six rounds to four, or Mundine six to four, or a five-all draw, then I'm happy with that. But clearly, Danny Green didn't win eight rounds to two or nine rounds to one. Not that the man himself is bothered much. He didn't win on one scorecard. One judge had it a draw, but he didn't win on one scorecard. So the, the, the judges um, saw the fight how most people saw it. As for the vanquished... People know in their hearts that watched the fight that was there, that witnessed the fight, who, who was the better man. He knows in his heart that I was the man again tonight. As it was, the fight was lucky to go the ten rounds after Green was caught by a Mundine cheap shot inside the first minute. Doctors wanting to stop the fight. Whilst the bout didn't end there, Paul Upham says an era of Aussie boxing definitely did last night. There was a long time where Danny Green and Anthony Mundine were the two stars of Australian boxing, but now in their 40s it's time for them to move on and retire. And there may be no more appropriate way for either fighter to go out. Sunil Awasti, SBS World News.